Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to what I like to call yet another Minecraft series. We're in uh, episode 5 and as you can see I'm standing on top of the House of Signs and at the top, but, but quite at the top. And uh, in the background you can see some bushes which you will not have seen in the previous episode but I added them off camera just to make it a little more pretty and I think it is. And as you can see, you can see the view is also very pretty. And yeah, I, I chose it because what we're doing today is uh, a little tour around our server because there's new stuff and we might start some new projects and I'd like to show you yeah, what I'm planning to do. But first, uh, we, we finished this uh, restaurant on top of the House of Science, the La Cupola. And well, I added yeah, uh, tiny details, uh, this flower pot and the golem. Uh, yeah, but we, we didn't see, uh, you, you didn't see the other floors. Um, I did them off camera. And yeah, let's, let's just have a look. It's, uh, yeah, floor number five in Germany or number six in the US. I talked about that confusion last time. Um, there are just two seminar rooms, one over here, which I left empty because it's, it can be modified to your needs. And over here we have one that I actually decorated. Uh, as you can see, a blackboard, which I, I thought would be nice. It, uh, I think there isn't one, but yeah, how would you notice it's a seminar room? Um, yeah, semicircle of chairs, and I put a, a flower in the center of this semicircle. And I did that for a reason, because in this room I first learned about theme-centered interaction. Uh, I won't go into detail what that is, but uh, if you're familiar with it, you will know why there is a flower pot with a flower in the center. I think that's yeah a, a nice little detail if you know why it's there. What else do we have? Two toilets, one for ladies, one for gentlemen. Uh, yeah, just a little storage area, but which is not too interesting. But let's head down here, which is more interesting, I think. It's, uh, let's get over here. It's the gallery above the assembly hall. And yeah, I'm not too proud of, uh, yeah, the lights hanging in here because it blocks, they block the view, but it's okay. Um, what do we see? We see, I put a little podium down there where people can, can climb up and give a speech or something like that. We have rows of chairs for the audience. And uh, yeah, that's a little messy. I, I actually tried to put a lion on uh, onto the banner, on the banner, onto the banner, on the banner. Um, yeah, but I think I need, uh, yeah, a charge creeper hat or the hat of a wither skeleton to, to make a real line. That's just, yeah, some quirky in my design I made. N not Should not uh, resemble a lion. Maybe we'll do that in the future when we, uh, yeah, creepy, there you are. I need you charged and your head uh, when we get you. Over here, uh, yeah, actually there's no, no carpet, but uh, yeah, it's just, in, in reality, this is just a plain room with nothing, um, nothing inside, bare walls. Yeah, I, I tried to make it a little more pretty, but um, yeah, I, I'll come back to that in just in a minute. Uh, what else do we have here? Uh, yeah, uh, just a toilet, as you can see. Obviously, there was a man here last time. We have a sink. Nothing too fancy. And down here, as you saw, yeah, the assembly hall. Yeah. Hello, fellows. It works. Yeah. Okay. Um, then over here, just again some yeah area which looks nicer here, but you will notice that the building is still kind of ugly, although I decorated it. Um, and I think it's okay because in reality this building is really ugly, to be honest. So I yeah. I don't think it makes sense to, to make it more than it is. 
Okay, uh, floor number two or three, whatever way you count, is um, part of the set notes. It's part, it's center of further edu education that resides here. And over here, I, I put an office. I don't know if there is an office over here, but I think it would be nice. Yeah, you can sit over here, grab some books, read. Uh, yeah, that's in here. And over here, I created two more seminar rooms, one over here, again, a blackboard looking a little different, uh, a table to work back here, some books, and yeah, similar over here, just facing this way, another blackboard. Um, what do we have here? Yeah, I put a sofa here. Actually, there's nothing again. It's plain ugly, but I think it would be appropriate for a center, center of further education. I don't know. Yeah, doc center of further education to yeah have a place where you can grab some books and read. All right, that's over here. Now, floor number one. Um, actually, there are offices. I still don't know. Yeah, who sits in sits in there? But in reality, there's a table over here where people can sit. And I try to make some nice looking offices. Yeah. Table with some plant decoration and books again. And we could even go go outside here. Oh, yeah. Have a little uh, a break from time to time. And again, an office over here, which is a little larger and has lots of books. And that's about it. Yeah, place to sit. And I was talking about projects we might start soon. Um, as uh, I, I said in the uh, second episode, I think, um, the House of Science is part of a larger compound and this is part of, yeah, another area. But yeah, I'm not too eager to, to collect clay and burn bricks, <laughs> at, at least not right now. So maybe we'll do something different. Okay, ground floor. There's um, not too much over here, just this entrance hall. Yeah, quite empty. I put this little fella over here, which is nothing too special. As you can see, it works, but has no real purpose. It's, as you can read, I, I put a sign on it, Infostation Elektromobilität. And that's because there's a little exhibition right now in the House of Science about, yeah, Elektromobilität, which is, uh, or uh, covers e-cars and hybrid cars and, um, yeah, sustainable energy and stuff like that. So I think some close down action was appropriate. Um, yeah, that's about it. We just have this room over here, which I made a storage area. There was a bistro here before, but it closed. So I don't know. You, you can't even look inside it. It's this room from the outside in reality. So I made a storage room and same over here. And that's it. That's the House of Science in Braunschweig in Germany. Yeah, let's have a final look before we carry on. That's it. Okay, um, what else might we have a look? Yeah, um, I mentioned that we're on Minecraft 1.8 right now, which came out uh, two days ago. It's, it's Thursday, September the 4th. And yeah, let's head down here. You can, uh, if you saw the first episode, you will notice that I put in some stairs. They're quite dangerous, not too fancy, but that's okay. It's a mine. And if we head down here, we'll eventually get to the place I have to check because some things might have changed in Minecraft 1.8 and we might have to repair some stuff. Yeah, just some decoration I put in here because um, there was, where was this gap and there was this gap and yeah, by coincidence, I made the entrance in here and I think it, yeah, it resembles face, doesn't it? The eyes and some large teeth and the mouth. So let's get down. 
where there we are um, yeah this cavern over there might become a new project maybe I'm going to put a city down here a real city because over here I also I, you know, also I, I you could say I started one this is my my mind shift where I get all my stuff where I find diamonds because we're on level eight, uh, eight, eight 11 and as you can see there's a little tree farm because I like to be independent and have my wood here and I, I don't have so I don't have to get up all the time um, what else do we have we have some chickens over there with water and uh, a little farm to get some food so uh, I think I, I, uh, I will move that over to um, the large cavern but let's yeah, yeah, let's go to the stuff I have to check. Um, over there, let's go in there first. There's a skeleton spawner. And in this observation chamber, have a look at it. There it is. A nice skeleton spawner, and it worked. It still works. Um, the spawner works, but my mob trap seems to be broken. And I think I, I first noticed this it in uh, Minecraft 1.8 pre version 2. And I just want to have a look if it still doesn't work. As you can see, it's, it's a yeah, standard mob trap. They come down here, they get beneath uh, this glass and should drown, or at least drown in 1.7, up to, or up to 1.7. But as you can see, they don't drown anymore and I guess I'll have to fix that or see if I can fix that hmm. I guess it's because their head is above water level and maybe I will have to put another layer of water above them to make it work again I don't know um, yeah that might be one of the projects we um, we can start and and yeah, hopefully finish, but uh, let's get up. Yeah, and I'll get up and, and see you. I'll meet you at the top, at the surface. Be right back. Okay, there we are, back at the surface. And our next station will be the Nether. And uh, we haven't actually seen it on this uh, Minecraft series. Because there was nothing too special but now there is and I wanted to show you that yeah, as you might remember um, yeah just some horse stables and, and sh some sheep and a barn over here from Anthagorian which is uh, which is a really nice barn my little house chicken coop we've seen that nothing new but then our nether portal is over here and since 1.8 and there's also a glitch I think but nothing too special we can fix it quickly I guess and yeah still there there are two parts missing of the portal yeah just I think we just have to to relight it uh, yeah but what, what do we have here over here we have our side project project breakthrough because you can actually get on top of the nether and we'll do that eventually and we need that stuff and some more ender pearls and then we can do it um what else do we have oh what's that i don't know that oh actually somebody put in a railway station here no, i do I don't have a mine cart okay uh, and just in case another uh, forest should be a fortress that's Okay, if you don't speak German, Außenposten is an outpost. I don't know what's meant with that. And <laughs> Neue Gefilde is lyrical for a uh, new area. So, how long is it actually? Yeah. Okay, portal to the village of Gralgor. Yeah, let's see how long it is. How far it goes over here tower spawner yeah we, we have a tower spawner in the overworld oh, it's long 
Okay, somebody did some work over here. Okay, what's up here? Do we have a sign? No. Oh, what's that? Oh! Nice, an observation area. Oh, I think that looks nice. Oh, what's down here? And, oh! Is it a fortress? Ah, oh, that's cool, an entrance to a fortress. That's convenient. That is convenient. Okay, um... Yeah, thank you. Don't have to watch me run. I'll meet you at the the entrance of Nether. Okay, there we are. Uh, one thing I did down here, although I hate the Nether, it's really yeah, it, it gives me the goosebumps sometimes. If there's a there's one one song that really creeps me. Um. Yeah, one thing I did down here when collecting a glowstone for the House of Science um, is over here. I marked it with this piece of stone. And as you can see, no, you, you can't see, but let's. Yeah, it's safe to get out. Let's get out. Um, it's over here. You can see glowstone over there, and I left one there. Glowstone over there. Is it glowstone? Why doesn't it glow? It is. Uh, some over there, and there's glowstone over there, over there and w it was too dangerous because, uh, yeah, there's lava down there, and I wonder why there's no guest. There were guests spawning everywhere, and I decided to secure this place by building this little fortress myself. It's my nether fortress, and uh, it's nothing too special. And get over here and yeah you, you can shoot guests from here which is quite nice and i think i will uh, uh build some more stuff over here because down there is a fortress and i think i will build some stairs down there so that will be, be my yeah <laughs> fortress to fortress path um over there you can see i, I brought some some dirt and some trees because I like to be independent and yeah let's head over there real quick it's not too far as you can see I think um, I will go down there to to get a path to the fortress and then build my way up with some stairs it's easier than bringing stacks and stacks and stacks of gravel to get down there Okay, where is there a guest? Okay, as you can see, some trees, my mini forest, just as I said, I like to be independent and if I need some wood in the nether, I don't want to go back to the overworld too often. So uh, yeah, that's what, what we could do in the nether. And yeah, let's head back. Oh, wait this way let's head back and i'll meet you in the real overworld where it's quiet and calm there we are back in the sun okay and we have a visitor but i'm not too visitor friendly right now okay uh let's head over there uh if you have seen episode number one, you know that there was a building that I could identify, and it's still, it's still there was a building, but it's still there, and it's that building over there. And yeah, oh, let's start here. Uh, we have this little tower, which is really cool, because I'll show you. It it serves a purpose. It's yeah, some kind of defense tower where you can climb up and take a shot and kill some mobs just in if, if they come over here or spawn spawn over here because this is a little mining village and miners need protection because they're not fighters and we'll see why uh, because uh, let's go to the, the building i mentioned 
before. Yeah, now you know what's going on. Over here, um, I said I couldn't identify it in last time. It is a mining station, or it turned out to be a mining station. Down here, yeah, long, long, long way down. There's a mine. And that way, over here, we have some furnaces to smelt stuff and chests to store stuff. And yeah, we need miners and miners, or it would be convenient for miners to live in a village that is close to the mine. And that's what you see here. Some houses. Yeah, as you can see, um, yeah, even villagers, I guess. And the guardian brought them here. What do we have here? Another house, different look. Well, it's quite nice. I haven't been here yet. Yeah. Yeah, what else do we have? Yeah, some more horses, houses over here. I've seen this one. It's also nice, isn't it? And I want to conclude this episode already with uh, one final thing which might become a project or will become a project actually it's this yeah you might wonder I, I came over here it didn't have a sign so I, I put my initials here with torches because I had lots of torches OT um, this is going to be become um, a smelter an auto smelter actually uh, I think there is enough space oh, uh, just in case you don't know what an auto smelter auto smelter is um, when I I built the house of science I needed lots of coal for smelting for burning bricks and yeah it decreased rapidly um, and I want to build a house with trees on top that you can chop down and just have to throw um, the, the trunks into a, a funnel, a, a hopper, and it will go to a furnace which automatically makes coal out of them. And this coal is automatically fueled to another furnace and that you can actually use for smelting. So you just come here, put your, your ore in maybe and yeah, wait some time and get your stuff. That's, that's an auto smelter. Quite convenient if you, from time to time, chop down some wood. So that's what I'm going to do here. And I'm not sure what I'll I'll do. Uh, as I said, I, I could repair the skeleton spawner or build an underground city or go to the nether and yeah, enlarge my fortress. But probably I will do this stuff first because yeah, people live here and maybe the, the, I guess they need it. So, um, yeah, I want to finish now because um, my previous episodes were quite long. And I think I will want to keep this one down to 20, 25 minutes in the future episodes as well. So, um, yeah, that's it for today. It's uh, uh, 10 to 7 actually I have to get to work <laughs> in a few minutes so have my full-time job and um, yeah but I guess we will see quickly because I have one interstitial so to speak um, I want to do before building this auto smelter so see you in the next episode I guess until then bye bye bye